Well, we were going to call it rolling with the winningest coach in Texas Tech soccer history, but rolling with stone had a nice ring to it. So welcome back for another season to open up on Friday at New Mexico and then back home on Sunday against Colorado State coach this time of year, game week for the first game of the season. What's that like as a coach? Do you kind of gear up getting ready for, for the next 20 to 25 games here? You know, there's a certain level of excitement when you start camp, and there's a certain level of excitement when you kind of break camp, and you get into one-a-days, and you're really tapering, and you're trying to get a jump back in your legs, because we certainly worked them really hard, but they worked so hard this summer that we did not have to uh, overdo it in preseason, which is also nice. Oh, what a finish! Are you kidding me? Best season in school history a year ago. I know you're kind of day by day and game by game at this point of the year here, but is there a point when you sit down with your team, you talk about big picture goals? I think the players have done some of that on their own. They've called some of their own meetings and just said, look, this is who we want to be this year. You know, from our perspective, we've just totally turned the focus inside and said, let's just be the best version of Tex Tech soccer that we can possibly be. Uh, we play a brand of soccer that's usually pretty fun to watch, and we just let the opponents, that aspect of it, you know, show up on game day, and then we do try to get after them. And the whole cliche of one day at a time, if you can manage to live that, it does make the season, I think, a little less stressful. Is it different now when you, opponents look at Texas Tech on the schedule? Now all of a sudden they see an NCAA tournament team, they see the team that's picked second in the, in the Big 12 this season, ranked in the preseason polls. Are you looked at differently now by the opposition? I think we've been looked at differently for a few years. I think that the teams that we've played and the conversations that I've had is people have given us some respect for the team that we were building. You know, I don't know if a preseason poll does anything that just irritates everyone. You know, well, they shouldn't be ranked, and Tech shouldn't be ranked, and this one shouldn't be ranked. Um, but for the most part, I think that we've played, uh, we've been a pretty good team here for the last two or three years. You know, I think from, a, from that standpoint, we've been, uh, we've been cooking pretty good here for a while. Okay, so most programs maybe like to dip their toe into the water, ease into the non-conference, but you jump right in on the road, no less, at New Mexico, very good ball club. It is, and we've had a great uh, series of games with them. We were able to catch them last year in the fall, which was a, a regular season game, um, but it's been back and forth. Uh, they know us extremely well, and we feel like we know them, so uh, we're excited about it, but we know that being away may tilt some things in their favor, and we've got to be able to fight through those things. And then you're back at home on Sunday, home opener, always good to be back in the friendly confines of John Walker Soccer Complex. Well, you know, we're hosting uh, Bill Hempen's brand new team at Colorado State. He was a guy that was in my wedding, a guy I played for <laughs> in college. So we're very close to talk about knowing each other well. The only thing I don't know, I don't know anything about his team because they're all brand new. Uh, the one thing I do know is they'll be organized, they'll be fit, and Bill will have something cooked up for us. There's no way he's just going to roll in here and, and, and because we've been playing for a while, let us have anything. So uh, Friday is going to have its own set of challenges and so is Sunday. On the road, season opener Friday against New Mexico, back at home, home opener, August 25th at 1 o'clock against Colorado State. Coach, we'll see you Sunday. Thanks.